Welcome to the pre-portal for Corrienne in Muirhead in Fruki. This is a beautiful four bedroom, two bathroom, detached, with a driveway and a garage. You've got countryside views, you've got log burners. This is a beautiful, beautiful family home and it's in a great location. This is the pre-portal, so it's an opportunity if you're in a position to proceed to make or sell an offer they cannot refuse before it goes to their websites, you can message me here directly. And likewise, you can contact the team on 01334 654 221 and I'm going to just take you on the tour. This is a stunning family home. So this is the property here. So the property starts at this part of the white wall, it goes all the way along here. And the driveway is just here, which is where we're going to head in a second. But I'm just going to flip it so that you can actually see just what is in front of the property as well. So we've got these great countryside views to the front. It's a really private road. There's only a couple of houses up here, so there's no one coming up here unless you live here or you have visitors, of course. We're going to head in. So as we head in, you'll see immediately you've got this extensive driveway. So you've got one car there. You're easily getting another two or three in this space here. You've got beautiful front garden as well. Really nice and beautiful property, the way that it's standing proud here as well. Isn't that lovely? You've got this nice space to the front, so you're getting the sun in the morning. What a great place to just lie and enjoy it. It's so peaceful, isn't it? You can't hear anything. It's just stunning. And we're going to head on in. So we come into the front porch. So great for hanging up the dog's leads, as you can imagine. You've got all that countryside out there, so great for the wellies, the boots, etc. So we're going to head in to the lower hallway. And instantly you can see how nice it is. Look at this big, lovely church pew seat. So it gives you an idea just of the depth of this hallway. But we are going to start upstairs. So we're going to head upstairs, which is just around here. Just move the baby gate. And as you can see, you've got great little nook here as well for all your reading materials, maybe your music collection, etc. You've got your loft access here too. And we're going to head in to bedroom number one straight ahead. So this is currently used as a nursery, but you can see it's a great size. Isn't that lovely? Really nice size room. Lovely and peaceful, isn't it? Head. <laughs> but look at the views. What a quiet place to have a nursery. Just stunning. So that's bedroom number one. And we'll head back out. You've got a nice big cupboard straight ahead here as well. Lots of storage with this property. Then we're going to head into bedroom number two, which is through here. And you can see you've got all this inbuilt storage space. Great sized room again. Really lovely sized double. I just flip the camera and you'll see the sheer space you have in here. It's a great size room, but all that storage as well. That's five, six wardrobes you have. But again, look at the view. Isn't that glorious? Just beautiful. Lots of walking to be had. So stunning view. Then we're going to head into the upper bathroom. So this is a four piece, so we head straight in. You've got a double vanity, immediately you can see just how spacious this is. You've got your WC, you've got your shower enclosure as well with your electric shower, and you've got your lovely big bath as well. Isn't that great? Lovely and bright as well with that big window there. It's a really nice size family bathroom, isn't it, on this level? Right, and now we're gonna head on downstairs. You can see this is lovely and bright in here as well. You've got a nice big window up here, so a lot of natural light coming in. We're heading back into the hallway again. You can just see how bright the hallway is as well. You've got great use of space here. You could potentially have a little home office here, perhaps under the stairwell, but again, great for the dog as well. So lots of space in here. And then we're gonna go into bedroom number three, which is here. So this is a, a double room again, as you can see, also being utilized as a home office. So it's a great space. Nice big furniture in here as well, but you've still got plenty of room. It's a lovely sized room. This one overlooks the front garden as well. So again, you can see just how peaceful it is. And that is bedroom number three. So we're gonna head back out into the hallway. But again, you've got a great seating area in this hallway off this bedroom as well, haven't you? Just so lovely. And then we're gonna head into bedroom number four. So bedroom number four can be used as another reception room if you wish. That's what this family are doing. 
but again it's a great size you've also got a log burner in here as well you've got this great bit of storage in there as well nice big window overlooking the front garden you literally cannot hear anything it's so peaceful it's not beautiful but again a great forced room isn't it as say bedroom or second reception room depends could be a fantastic home office for someone maybe a studio as well because it's so bright if you're working from home so you can see just how much space you have here and then the hallway just comes all the way around along the house you've got great storage here as well and then you have a shower room in here as well so the beauty of this property is you also have the one level living so you've got the bedrooms and the washrooms so again you've got your vanity unit your wc lovely and bright with the double windows you've got a nice shower with your thermostatic controls as well just a great space and then we come into the hallway and we'll go into the lounge area which actually i think is my favorite room when we head into the lounge this is just such a great sized room look at that isn't that beautiful so peaceful on a day like today as well, the fire roaring, it's really, I wish you could feel just how lovely it feels in this room. But the sheer size of that window as well, isn't that a great sized room? Stunning, isn't it? So this is the hub of the home, as you can see the way all the seating is arranged. And look at the view that you have, isn't that gorgeous? Pops up toy outside, so everyone's getting to play. <laughs> It's just so nice, but I love this log burner with the mantle as well. So you've got the slate going around the log burner, isn't that nice? Really centrepiece of the room. The light hanging down as well, I just think it's fabulous. But I think you'll agree that's a great size room, isn't it? Then from here, we're going to head into the kitchen diner. Again, this is a great space. Cent central hub again to the family. I love all the glass that's in here too, so it just makes it feel really bright and open, doesn't it? So we come in, and again, you see your kitchen area. So lovely, nice size kitchen. You've got all this window, so it's really nice and bright. You've got a social dining space and social space at the end. So we'll come into the kitchen part first. So plenty of space for your freestandings, as you can see. But again, look at that gorgeous view. So quiet. You've got your integrated appliances. So you have your hob, your extractor. You've got your oven and your upper oven. So you've got your double layer. You've also got your integrated dishwasher. Plenty of space for your freestandings, but you've got all this cupboard space is great. And you're in the hub of the entertaining as well. So if you've got friends over, family, you're cooking, you're not missing out on anything. And then you've got this lovely dining space as well as having the breakfasting area as well. House is very autumnal. It's appropriate for this time of year, isn't it? And then you come down here, which is where they've really got all their entertaining that happens. Their music space, their entertaining. They've got all that cupboard to do in the bar area. But if I come down here, you get a feel of just the sheer length of this room. Isn't it lovely? But it's also great at the top of the room, you can access the rear garden as well. So you've got a kind of back porch as well as the front porch. And this is brilliant if you've been out in the hills, walking around, bring the dog in. The children just come in the door and dump the wellies no mess coming into the house so nice as a little bit room wouldn't it but we're going to head out into the garden to the rear and we get to the garden from here and it's such a great space very tranquil isn't that lovely you cannot hear anything this is a lovely big space. So we're going to head down to this end of the garden. So this is at the kind of end of your drive. So when you open those gates, you can actually bring further cars in here. So you've got one in the drive, you've got another room for three or four in the drive, and you've got this additional space. But look at the garden, look at the views. It's just stunning. And that's the sheer length of it. So good, nice patio area. But you've got a nice lounging area as well. You've got your big double garage here. So lots of storage, cars if you're into motorbikes or workshop. You've got a nice patio area here as well. You've got your drying space. Then you've got this entertaining space as well with the, the benches for picnicking and barbecuing and just out here enjoying your family life. You've got wood store area over here as well. But the views 
are just absolutely stunning. I can't hear anything. It's just so pretty. And that's the, the rear of the house. Isn't that lovely? So, Corian, it's a beautiful family home. You've got four bedrooms, two bathrooms. You've got that large garage area. You've got extensive driveway for off-street parking. You're in a quiet road. There's literally no one coming through here. You've got this gorgeous countryside views behind us. Where is this in relation to everything? So, it's close to Fruki. You're also close to Falkland. So you've got the palace, you've got the gardens, you've got everything that the town offers in Falkland. You're literally four minutes to Glenrothes. You're about a 15 minute drive and you're at Cooper. You're six minutes to Ladybank train station. You've also can go to Cooper train station, everything in Cooper that it offers. You've got the high street, the shops, the retail park, the restaurants, the bars, if you want to go out and have a social evening as well. But it gives you that rail link as well to Dundee and North and beyond, and also to Edinburgh and South and beyond. So it's in a great location. You've got lots of countryside walks. You're close to the Lomond Hills as well. So for outdoor people, this is fabulous. Cycling and walking paths, so much to do here. This family's dog as well, just loves the roaming here as well. And this morning I actually saw grouse and everything so it's just such a lovely tranquil place to bring up a family really peaceful this is pre-portal so it is an opportunity if you're in a position to proceed make our seller an offer they cannot refuse before it goes to the websites you can message me here directly likewise you can contact the team on 01334 654 221 this one's coming to market offers over £345,000 and I think you'll agree it's a beautiful home in a great location that offers fantastic family lifestyle and it's Perry at Five Property TV. Take care. Bye-bye.